For some, art is a hobby. For Dwight, art is a journey, a path he's been on for almost 50 years. I'm only 80. I mean, why stop? Dwight's route consists of day trips, at least once a week since 1968. Been down a lot of dirt roads, yeah. Each trip is a new stop. Each stop is a new memory. Some of them I've done long ago. Uh, I find that uh, we're better than some of the things I'm doing now. He's always in search of the same thing, something different. What you do is you kind of look for uh, something that has its own beauty and that maybe nobody else recognizes. Today, Dwight prefers company. You ready? To help him stay on course. Just funny things happen everywhere we go. So they hit the road until it feels just right. On a good spot, Dwight. You, know, you need to make the beauty where it is and see the beauty where it is. This time, they spot beauty off a highway into Grimes. I mean, nobody gets as excited about it as I do. So they set up. <laughs> I wanted you to talk about your Pochon box. Yeah. And get nestled in. Hidden gems are everywhere. He's lost count of how many trips he's taken. Certainly uh, five or six hundred, I don't know. Because it really doesn't matter. Once you have sat and painted something, it, it's in your mind forever. He's a lawyer by trade, but out here, there are few objections. I don't have to worry about getting this barn quite right because nobody knows about this barn but us. Dwight's in no rush. I often will come out from a day like this when it's been windy and my wife will say, well, was it awfully windy out? And I'll say, I don't know. I've been absorbed in the painting. He takes his time to explore and create his journey. And every, every painting doesn't have to be a masterpiece. For Dwight, the masterpiece is the big picture. When I grow up, I want to be an artist. <laughs> and, and uh, you know, I'm not sure when I'm going to grow up.